it together, Aaron the Black Dragon's back, and I welcome all of you to the last episode of Kingdom New Lands on Monday Madness. So, we explored a lot. We are on the new island, so let's see what is on this island. We already found something that was rather interesting over on this side. Yes, I think it was that side. Yeah, because there's the ship and I ran to the left first. And there was a wooden house or a stone house. I'm not sure about that. Super horsey. Perfect. God damn it. Starting the last episode with a lame horse. Is that free? Well, whatever. There is a ho house. There it is. And we can do something with that house. But I don't know what. And that is what we're going to figure out now. There's a person. Oops. I have that person with me now. Well, okay then. You are with me. Are you hunting? What are you doing for me exactly? So let's let let's eat up horsey. Let's let's go explore to this side. I know that somewhere around here was the next portal. <laughs> And that portal is active. That is not good. I wanted to check out what is behind that portal. But it seems like we are not able to do so. So we're gonna go around and check on the other side. And bring that person to our camp. And figure out if he or she does something over there. And then we're gonna check out over on the other side. During the night? Yeah, I don't know. We're gonna figure that one out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shoot them. Kill them deers. I've only... A little bit of archers. What do you do exactly for me? I'm more confused than ever with you. And also, I don't have a camp anywhere nearby. So that's also not really... There is a camp over here, but I'm not going to try to get to that camp right now. Because it's getting dark, so... Winning out the attack on this island and figuring out what to do. Okay, it's going to get... We're going to get an attack from this side. It seems like horse, uh, horsey. Wolfie, or doggy, tells us. And whatever. Let's see if some of my people got some money for me. Do you have some money to spare for your old king? No. How about you, my fellas? Do you have some money to spare? No. So that means we don't have any money at all. We are poor. There also is no merchant this time. And for some odd reason, I think the layout looks more like the original kingdom. So whatever that may mean. So does that mean there is going to be a chest now that appears? Because there is no merchant. You killed them, okay. Those were all of them? Good, then we are going to check out what's on this side. I know that there are some people that I can recruit, I'm gonna do that. And hope that we find something interesting over here. I would like a treasure chest, for example. Because with a treasure chest, I would have a little bit of mo spare money. Like that, yeah, give it to me. Ooh, yeah. Thanks for that. Whoops, I punched my mic. Also kinda need that, so good that I ran into you. And now we're gonna check out what's on this side. Good portal is not active. That's okay, there is the archer statue, that's good. The only thing that could make the archer statue better is if I get to know that I have to actually go that way. Because then I would have the archer statue on my side all the time without having to run through the portal every time. But that is something we gotta figure out. I'm not gonna recruit those guys because they are behind the portal. There's another portal over here, so double portal. That's not good. And still... Still nothing. But... That seems to be the way we have to go, so that's good. So the statue is actually in our possession in this one. 
We are going to where the statue is standing. So let's get out of here. Prepare our cap a little bit more and the next day we're gonna check out the other side. That's not good, portal is active. That's not good, gonna run away now. I swear to God, horsey, I'm gonna punch you. And... Yuck. Okay, got some money from you guys finally. You good? We can run? Good. Hey, there is that person now. I totally missed that she jumped off. It, it is a her, she, but what does she do for me? She jumps up on the horse. And that's about it. I can think of 10 better things that could happen, but I don't get what she's supposed to do for me. Huh. And we are at the hell portal now on the left side. So first of all, what I figured out, uh, the person we got from the house, she jumps off now as soon as we want to leave the camp, it appears. Or at least at night she jumps off. So, that is something, and also, I don't have any money for you, damn it. And also, I think we lost the dog when we ran past the portal, I'm not sure though, because I haven't seen him since that, so, there might have something happened. There are really... Not a lot of portal uh, camps out here. And there is the stone cliff. So, okay, that means there is nothing of interest over on this side. Oh, God, horsey. Catch a breath. Okay, guys, I'm gonna meet you back at the camp because I have to run all the way back now. With a stupid horse that can't run five feet. Gonna take that with me, though. I really hate my horse, by the way. Hey guys! Guess what? It's in the middle of the night. Take that coin, leave me alone. I wasn't fast enough to get back to camp because this stupid horse can't run for shit! See, the moon is rising up. I got attacked out here because I can't run with that horse! Okay, guys, so I'm back at camp. Oh, you have some money for me? Thank you very much. I don't know what your deal is still. So, back at camp. We really look desperate. I'm actually looking very desperate for money as well, because my guys are not hunting very much. So that is... God damn it. Come on, let me cut down this tree. Yeah, that's why I'm gonna cut down those trees and get to the ship at least on this side. It's raining, that means we're gonna have a bad time. And I don't have a lot of people and my horsey can't run again. God damn you, stupid horse. God damn. There are three trees really clustered up. Gonna cut as many of them as possible right now. And then recruit those two guys right here. You ran for the wrong coins, you idiot. You are not supposed to have that coin, my friend. They really got on my nerves right now. So cutting down the trees, get money out of them. Making my archers somewhat valuable for me. I need better walls, but if all my... Let's do that. No, oh, god damn it. Give me the money. I need the money. We need to make better walls. Okay. Okay. Please build up the wall as fast as possible. I also could have probably just done that. No, because we're not to that part yet. Whoopsie. Just wasted the money on that, didn't I? 
Well, I need it later on anyway, so... It's okay, I think. There is my treasury, dude. And now I don't have any money to spare for the other wall. That's not good. It's really not good. But hey, if we're going down, we're going down with a firebird. I'd say at least. Okay, so let's see what is going to happen tonight. Because it doesn't look good. So, what I'm gonna try right now is... Gonna have her on my back and see if she... Helps the moral of my guys? Nothing over here. Nothing over there. Okay. Where are they coming from? Um. Oh, there we are. I'm going to stand right here with my guys. Uh. Come on, you can kill them before they get in. I really don't know what she's doing for me. The archers don't seem to be any better than usual, but... Hey, whatever. Do I have enough coins for that? I need six. Yes, I have enough coins for that. Let's do this. And now I'm out of money. Well, this is the best way to finish off this series. By me freaking up the whole game. Well, I can say fucking up the whole game because that's essentially what I'm doing right now. But I was too interested in too, interested in too much stuff at once, and this is what's gonna bite me in my buttocks now. Well, whatever. Give me that money. We have one new guy in the camp. That means we need one more bow. Oh, money! They made some money over here. You guys are actually really good at making money now that you have some spots to hunt. Okay, need to get rid of those trees here. So that I can enlarge the camp on this side a little bit. But not only for me, but also for my hunters. And also for the safety of the builders, so that they can do that without being attacked, per potentially. I mean, you also could probably do this only during the daytime and risk a lot with it but I feel actually a lot safer doing it that way even though a lot of you may say that it's a stupid idea I know that but again we're gonna finish this today so I don't care about if we're going to do a mistake or not yeah now and also wouldn't hurt to have some farmers now because the game taught me uh, in the later game, now in the last stage, that getting money is getting harder. And if I have farmers now, I'm not gonna have so much problem with them. I really don't know what she's doing with me. I have no clue. She stays with me the whole day, but at night she jumps off the horse and minds her own business. So I don't get the purpose of her. Maybe she has something very special to her. Maybe I can do something with her and the statue. I don't know that. I don't have also don't have the money to try it out, so that's that as well. So let's just stay here and outweigh the attack. Okay guys on this side nothing happened, that's okay with me. So I can actually start, whoa, give back the money. I build up this side now to make it uh, profitable for me. So I'm gonna make the farm here and I'm gonna get a lot of, a lot, a lot of farmers in here and also gonna upgrade this wall right here. And Make the forest disappear so that my archers have some places to far uh, to hunt, not to farm. Suddenly music. It was super quiet the whole time and now all of a sudden music really kicked up. 
It startled me a little bit, game. I'm not gonna lie about that. Also, where's my farmer? There you are. Ah, oh, yeah. The last monster wave tries to get into a little camp here. But little do they know that they never have any chance to enter this camp. Not now. Not next week. Not ever. Because with this attack, I'm gonna leave this series now. Day 8 and we finish off the whole season. Season. Series. It was super fun to revisit the whole uh, game again. Um, as I already said, Mandamatis, I'm not going to do a whole playthrough of the complete game. But it was super fun uh, looking into the game again. It also was very interesting to see what changes to brought with the new version of New Lands. So I really like it. It's much more complex than the original was. And that is something that I really enjoyed. That you could not just take the same uh, uh, method that you had in the normal game and apply it here. You had to think a bit differently, you had to build your borders differently and also the way you get your money was extremely different than it was in the normal game. So I really liked what they did with the game and I'm looking forward to see more from them to come because I really enjoyed that game and um, yeah, I'm happy to see more from them as I said already. So I'm gonna press the escape button again for the pause menu because that is where we're gonna leave this series next week we're gonna jump into something completely known new I'm not gonna tell you what it is right now but you're gonna figure it out next week so guys I hope you enjoyed this episode the last episode if you did please leave a comment down below I really would appreciate that and hope to see all of you to next week's new series on Monday Madness so bye